local gym that's defied orders to close was cited today by San Diego police. Boulevard Fitness in University Heights has stayed open and allowed members to work out with new protocols in place. Fox 5's Andrew Nomura has the new information. Andrew. Well, Kathleen, business was usual here at Boulevard Fitness, although the gym was slapped with a fine by San Diego PD. It doesn't show any signs of closing. Boulevard Fitness, a place known for building muscle, is now under a serious bar of intense pressure to close. We have and continue to see a handful uh, of bad faith actors. County leaders announced Tuesday the University Heights gym was slapped with a fine from San Diego PD after refusing to close, which is in violation of the state and county health order that requires all gyms to stop indoor operations. Only serves to punish those entities that are following the rules and doing everything right and only serves to have the potential to set our region back. A few weeks ago, Boulevard Fitness made news after gym owner Sean Gilbert refused to close his doors when he was delivered a cease and desist order. At the time, Gilbert made it clear he does not plan on closing indoor operations, citing the immense amount of work he had to put in to start his business and the strain he felt during the initial shutdown. As long as they're following protocols right now, I think it's, it's probably okay. Well, we've seen other gyms across the county shut down, like the gym in Pacific Beach, who was tied to a coronavirus outbreak. The Ramona Fitness Center is now facing charges after refusing to close its doors. They got to shut down. That's it. If it. You know, cases are spreading and they're on the rise in San Diego, then they should shut down if that continues to happen. Well, we reached out to the gym owner to get comment about receiving that fine. He told us no comment. For now, we're live here in University Heights. I'm Andrew Nomura, Fox 5 News.